One of the biggest misconceptions about behavior change that I've been talking to people about for almost a decade now is that struggles are strugg their struggles with behavior change are struggles of willpower. And I can definitely understand why it feels that way because uh, you're struggling every day to try to do something that feels important to you. But the reality is that most failures of uh, behavior change are not failures of willpower. They're failures of focus. So willpower is unlimited resource. Uh, it is like going to the bank and constantly cashing checks. Um, and lots of things can impact your supply of willpower, like how well you're sleeping, how consistently your uh, blood sugar is, um, things like that, that and lots of little decisions that we make throughout the day keep taking money out of that account. The reality is that almost everyone by the end of the day is operating in what psychologists call a state of ego depletion, uh, where they're almost out of available willpower and operating solely on habit. As willpower goes away, the thing that takes over is habit. So most people who are struggling towards the end of the day with something like behavior change are not, are struggling because the, the tank is empty. They don't have anything left and they're operating solely on habit. The smart thing to do is not ask, how do I get more willpower? It's how do I create the conditions that make success more likely? So the, what, those conditions are, what, what those conditions look like are conditions where you're constantly being reminded to do a little bit each day, constantly being reminded that, oh yeah, this is a priority. This is something that I want and I'm gonna take a little bit of a step towards it. And the easiest way to create those conditions is social is being in a community where you're constantly seeing other people's success, where people are talking about it, and it's bubbling up. You're reminded that this is an important thing to do. And the more people in that community who are on that same mission, the more good ideas you probably are gonna get. So most of the struggles that I've seen have been that people are struggling alone and they're running out of, they're running out of willpower and they're not taking tiny little steps, they're taking big steps. All of that works together to just create this conditions of almost guaranteed failure. So the smart play is to not struggle against willpower. The smart play is to say, I know that I'm going to forget. I know that it's going to not going to be a priority and I know that I need to make small changes. How do I create the conditions which I am going to constantly be reminded that, oh yeah, this is an important thing to me. And the answer is a social community, a community where other people are going through the same thing and you're being constantly triggered to do that new behavior and to reflect back on it. So once again, most failures of behavior change are not failures of willpower. They're failures of focus and they're failures of they're struggling trying to do it alone. So I hope that's been helpful. Um, I've been saying it a lot and I constantly come up with new and different ways to say it. Um, but that is the biggest mistake that I see people make doing it alone and trying to do it with willpower.